My name is Dr. David Glazier. I specialize in female pelvic health and reconstructive surgery, and I work at Retreat Hospital. Urinary incontinence is a tremendously devastating condition that affects millions of patients a year. 50% of women over the age of 50 may leak at some time in their lifetime. What is leakage? It's where people cough, sneeze, and laugh, and they leak. It has a negative impact on the quality of life. It uh, can have a devastating effect uh, where people no longer go to church because they leak so much. Uh, they can't go to parties or can't go out and socialize with friends. It's not one stop that fits all. For uh, leakage, you could do an exercise program with a focused physical therapist who can help you get regain complete control of your leakage. There are other options such as Botox, where you inject Botox into your bladder, which can help you 70% of the time with the gotta go, gotta go type of leakage. We can also offer a minimally invasive surgery with slings, where we put a small um, a piece of mesh around the tube coming out of the bladder, and that can get rid of leakage with coughing and sneezing up to 90% of the time. We should uh, try and decide to do the least invasive thing first, not everybody needs surgery. A lot of people will do very well without any surgical intervention. If there is a need for surgery, we now know it's minimally invasive. People return to work very quickly. There's very little need for pain control afterwards because of these therapies. Urinary incontinence or urinary leakage really affects patients' quality of life. There is so much you can do to help patients. We individualize each patient's care a lot of the time, you don't need to go to surgical interventions. There's a lot of things we can do before, such as an exercise programs or medications that can really help you.